All right, hello everybody. Welcome to another video from AA Sports Cards. After a few stops and starts with this particular item, I'm finally ready to uh, go to camera. Uh, I actually purchased this today, which uh, is always great. Most of my business lately has been on consignment, but I actually bought this outright uh, earlier today from a gentleman. Uh, he hand delivered it to me, but I always kind of want to show any sort of packaging this is how we brought it wrapped up in in saran but we'll get rid of that and get rid of that so what this is is a uh, program from the 1972 summit series canada versus russia the program is very cool very neat great artwork and text but it's quite common it was the same program sold at every game across canada uh, so whether you went to the game at the Montreal Forum or the Pacific Coliseum in Vancouver uh, or in Hamilton at Cops Coliseum, I believe, it was the same program. What makes this uh, purchase very, very cool is I have never had these items before. I'm going to cover the gentleman's um, name there. But from what he told me, um, the way to get tickets to the games in 1972 were you had to uh, enter a lottery and there would be coupons in the newspaper. In this case, I am imagining it would have been the Toronto Star or the Toronto Sun. And you filled out a, um, a coupon and mailed it away. And this gentleman and his dad, and you can see the postmark from uh, 1972 on there, right there. This gentleman and his father um, bought a lot of newspapers uh, and filled out a lot of coupons and uh, their efforts paid off handsomely as they got two tickets to game number two at Toronto's Maple Leaf Gardens on September 4th, 1972. This is um, any stub from the four Canadian games and there were only four is historic. This, uh, this game was Canada's first win after a shocking defeat in game number one. Uh, Tony Esposito was in goal uh, after Ken Dryden lost game number one. And most importantly, it was Canada's first victory in the series. I believe the final score was 4-1. Uh, in addition to the tickets and the envelope that the, t that the tickets came in is this item. And what this basically is, is instructions to people that were successful in winning tickets on how to get their tickets, what to pay for, uh, how to pay for them, etc. The incredible thing is, if the camera pans in, tickets were $15. Now, that seems incredibly uh, low today in the, um, in the era of four-figure tickets to Super Bowls or Stanley Cup Finals. But... 50 years ago, that was a lot of money to go to a game. In comparison, the top seat at the Pacific Coliseum in Vancouver for a Canuck game was uh, $8. So it was almost double uh, for this tournament, but anybody that was there, including this gentleman, the memories are, uh, are well worth it. And the last thing I wanted to say was ticket stubs have become very, very, uh, popular and, and strong sellers in some rivaling, rivaling, uh, rivaling cards. The main reason, I think, is because now there are no more ticket stubs. If you go to a game, you get a, a, you know, a, a ticket sent to your phone or an electronic ticket. For those of us that can remember, in an age before cell phones uh, and cameras, this was your immediate reminder the morning after that you went to a game that you'd actually been there. This was proof to show your friends that you had attended the game. So uh, two historic ticket stubs to a historic game, two ticket stubs to a historic game, the mailer, the envelope, the program. Please watch for these items on eBay uh, under our selling site, which is Vahuta, V-A-H-O-O-T-A. Thanks everybody for watching and uh, we'll be back with more videos very soon.